Welcome to my channel. I'm Zhang Jingxu. Let's look at the problem twenty-three in chapter twenty-two. Chapter twenty-two is about Gaussian's law. We can see we have a solid mental cube, the keyword mental cube, and there is a spherical cavity at the center located a pointed charge called Q, right? And then this mental cube carries a new charge, the smaller Q. As Q first one, the total charge on the surface of the spherical cavity. This is the this uh, surface of this uh, cavity. We can see, um, this uh, cube is a conductor because I told you this is a mental cube. So conductor for conductors, the charges will located at its surface, right? Yes, and then we can see inside this uh, cavity. This is a positive Q. So there will be the inductive charge located at the surface for this covered. Agree? Negative Q to keep it balanced. Agree? Therefore, the total charge on the surface of this spherical covered is negative of the Q. That is a negative 8 microcoulomb. Agree? The next one asks you the total charge on the outer surface. So on the outer surface, we can consider the outer surface is just equal to the charges for the net charge, right? Because any charge on the conducting materials must be located at its boundaries. The boundary is just the outer surface. This is the net charge Q, capital Q, plus the, the little Q. Thank you.